Hi everyone. Recently I noticed some uh, issues with uh, YouTube uh, that I want to share with you. Um, for I think uh, I noticed some uh, issues that, that might be helpful for everyone. And I also want to give you, uh, y you know, maybe some insights and uh, some, uh, uh, you know, some, some advice. Um, the most obvious uh, thing uh, that probably everyone noticed by now is that uh, recently basically everyone has been uh, losing subscribers. And uh, this has been going on for, for a couple of days now. Of course, um, people have always been losing subscribers and there, there were various reasons for this. But uh, in, 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 in the last few days, everyone has been losing subscribers on a massive scale and it's still going on. People continue to lose their subscribers. Uh, uh, on a on a scale that that is unprecedented, so uh, a lot of people don't really know what's going on. There's a lot of speculation going on, a lot of theories that can't really explain it why this is happening on such a large scale, and it's not a one-time thing either. This has been going on for about a week now, and it's continuing. So something definitely changed <laughs> um, something is different and people are lose definitely losing more subscribers uh, than they used to it's it's not just YouTube's usual clean up you know um, and it's also not like some people even speculated that YouTube has been hacked that might have been the case but that still does not explain wh why this is still ongoing if they would have really if, if that would really have been the, the, uh, the reason why that happened, I'm sure they would have fixed it by now. But uh, uh, people are still losing subscribers. And uh, it's not only inactive subscribers. A lot of people, because this has happened in the past and people were losing inactive subscribers every time YouTube does a cleanup. Um, but this time it's not only inactive subscribers uh, that are um, uh, being lost and you know some people um, also try to cheat and uh, they they are buying uh, subscribers um, but uh, this is not only happening to those people uh, this is happening to everyone it's not only inactive subscribers that are being lost it's not only subscribers that have been bought that are being lost it's it's everyone everyone is affected it has nothing to do with uh, the subscribers being active or inactive or you know n nothing like that and also i did some testing and i noticed that the subscribers are not really being lost and uh, first off it's not true that the subscribers uh, 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 everyone is losing, that those are uh, inactive subscribers or that those are subscribers that uh, whose accounts has been deleted like it was the case in the past. Um, I did some tests and I noticed uh, the subscribers are uh, actually still there. Actually, as, as far as I can tell, the subscribers have not been lost at all. The, the, the people you have been losing as subscribers, they're still there. Their accounts are still active. They might very well still be watching your videos and they're actually still subscribed to you. At least uh, uh, for them, they're still subscribed. They still get updates. When you upload a video, it still shows up in their subscriber feed. And they and, and 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 when they visit your channel, it still shows uh, shows them that they are subscribed. But when you look into your statistics, they they no longer count as your subscribers in your statistic, but not in theirs. So it's only it's only from 
from your perspective <laughs> that you have lost subscribers but it's like of course it's like that for everyone everyone seems to have lost subscribers but what i really think is happening is that in reality no one has lost subscribers it's just that then they're not showing up that some subscribers for whatever reason are no longer showing up in your statistic in actuality they're still subscribed and they're still active and they haven't been deleted <laughs> they're actually still your subscribers they're just not showing up in your statistic now this this could have been you know uh, uh, some kind of error or this could have been that maybe because somebody hacked youtube but this has been going on for like a week now or longer and uh, as i said i don't think that, that can explain it because then they would have fixed it by now right so what i really think that is happening is um, I said earlier that it has nothing to do with buying subscribers but now that I think about it indirectly it might because what I think is happening is that um, YouTube is uh, um, probably trying um, to uh, you know get rid of all those people who have been selling subscribers and uh, YouTube can't really uh, precisely tell which subscribers have been bought and which haven't been which are genuine subscribers uh, so what I think they're doing is they're just kind of um, they're not unsubscribing anybody but they're not showing you uh, certain subscribers that uh, they think are fishy, you know. Um, there might not really be anything wrong with those subscribers. Um, they probably are real people really interested in your channel and who are really watching your videos. But they, they, there might be something, you know, that is kind of... Uh, uh, making YouTube think that they're fishy, a little fishy, you know, like maybe they have subscribed to a lot of people, you know, maybe, maybe they have, they, they might be really interested and, and everything's fine, but they just might have subscribed to, to a lot, a lot of people recently. A lot of people do that uh, because they hope that you will subscribe to them in return, which of course is also something that YouTube doesn't really like. So, um, so, for example, I think that when somebody has subscribed to a lot of people, then uh, they will not unsubscribe him because, for all they know, he could really be interested in their channel and he might really be watching their videos. Uh, but uh, so, so they they will not uh, they will not uh, unsubscribe him. Uh, but what they will do is they will not show his subscription to you which explains why everyone has been losing subscribers. In reality, they haven't. In reality, the subscribers are just not shown uh, uh, to the person that has been subscribed to. But to the person who is subscribed, he still gets video updates, as I said, um, and I tested this. So I think what they're trying to accomplish is that in this way, um, you know, the, the, the person who are subscribing they don't they won't notice it they will still be subscribed and they can still watch your videos um, but the uh, the person who gets subscribed to will not see these people in his uh, statistics that way you cannot sell subscribers because uh, there would be no way for the person who has sold subscribers to prove that he has because they will not show up in the other person's statistics and of course a lot of people you know who who are really genuine subscribers they will not show up either but uh, they will still uh, get your video updates so I think uh, this is what uh, what's behind this I, I think this is all intentional um, yeah um, <laughs> so basically what this means is that from now on your subscriber number uh, it really doesn't say anything because you know it might show you a really low number of subscribers but you might have in reality you might have 
many more subscribers and they're just not shown to you so actually that means that from now on it seems like your subscriber count is um, pretty much useless <laughs> Um, which brings me to some other things I noticed. Uh, now, uh, I'm not the first person to notice this, but uh, I think a lot of people, well, they, they probably know it, or but they're not really thinking about it, they're not really aware of it. So, uh, yeah, um, it's, it's a little, you know, little sneaky things YouTube does. Uh, <laughs> for example, um they know what you're saying in in your video they do because uh they automatically <laughs> uh generate a script from everything you've said in your video and uh they use it for various things for what exactly they're using it i'm not really sure but they're also using it for some sneaky things you know i think mostly they using it you know as uh metadata for the uh, for the search engine so and and this has been tested and and i also tested this and and this really works so for example if um if you if you say a, a, a certain keyword in your uh in your video and you don't have that keyword anywhere else you don't have it in your description you don't have it in your title you don't have it in your in your tags you don't have it anywhere you just mention that word in your video and then you search for that word your video will come up because yeah as I said YouTube knows everything that you're saying in your video and a lot of people have tested this uh, it, it's just that maybe recently um, YouTube uh, uh, is, is, is trying to hide this fact a little so I don't know I haven't tested it recently but they, they, so it might it might not be that that it still works, you know, for for searches. I, I don't know that, but they definitely know what you're saying, and I don't know for what purposes they're using that. But I'm sure they're using it for something sneaky. <laughs> and uh, uh, yeah, and 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 and, and talking about um, YouTube understanding what you're saying and YouTube being sneaky about it. Um, this is also something I tested. I don't know if this if this uh, if this applies for the videos, but this might even apply for the videos. But if it does apply for the videos, we'll find out now, won't we? Because it's the following. I noticed um, that uh, uh, when you when you post a comment and you say something that is uh, critical of uh, uh, YouTube or of uh, the company who's running YouTube, whose name I will intentionally not say right now because I'm sure they will uh, <clears throat> understand that name. <clears throat> so, <laughs> so I'm avoiding a certain keyword now. <laughs> we'll see if that helps. <laughs> but uh, <clears throat> I, I, I posted some uh, uh, text comments where I have uh, criticized a certain company <clears throat> which owns YouTube <clears throat> and um, I noticed that those comments have all been filtered. <laughs> Isn't that funny? You know, and of course, I didn't. If you're posting those comments, you will not notice it. They won't. They will. They will delete your. Or, well, they will not. It's not that they will delete your comments. They will not show your comments, but they will show them to you. So to you, it looks like everything's fine. You posted those comments, and even to the person. Uh, who, who who made the video um, uh, on which you are commenting those comments will show up just fine but to anyone else they will just not show up <laughs> so you can test this for yourself you know try try criticizing a certain company <clears throat> and and then and look at it if you can look look if you can see your comments with a different account <laughs> so YouTube is being pretty sneaky uh yeah and i suspect they might be doing the same with videos so if nobody ends up watching this video <laughs> it's either because i'm horrible at making videos or it's because uh youtube uh is uh filtering out um 
uh, uh, videos with uh, content it doesn't like. Or maybe it's a combination of both. <clears throat> yeah. Now, of course, I'm sure YouTube is uh, not the only company who can do stuff like that. Um, I'm sure there are other companies which, uh, with, uh, with much more uh, sinister intentions, because everyone is always, you know, um, kind of bashing the company that owns YouTube. But, uh, well, I don't know. I, well, I am kind of criticizing them, aren't I, right? But, I, I, so, I, I'm, I'm definitely not defending them. I'd probably be the last person to be defending them. Uh, but if they can do that, uh, if they have that technology, you can be sure that other um, entities <laughs> have that technology too. So, for example, if you can read what's written in Chinese on my t-shirt, uh, then uh, maybe you will get what I'm hinting at. Yeah. So, if, um, for example, if, if YouTube can understand what you're saying in a video and can then um, censor or hide your video uh, accordingly, uh, you can be pretty sure that, for example, uh, you know, the... Uh, uh, <clears throat> Uh, well, for example, certain governments, uh, certain very restrictive governments, <clears throat> maybe governments run by certain parties or, or by a certain party, for example, the Communist Party or some other socialist party that might be rather restrictive, you can be sure they have that technology too. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, they probably had that technology 10 years before uh, YouTube ever used that technology. So, yeah, and they're using it for uh, things that are definitely more sinister than what YouTube is doing with that technology. Anyway, uh, uh, that, that, that doesn't mean that I'm defending YouTube, not at all. Uh, uh, actually, uh, I, don't, I don't really like YouTube, honestly. I don't, I don't like what YouTube has become since it has been run by that certain company that has bought it, and uh, yeah, I, I don't, I don't like it. It was, it was different in the past. You, you, it was different. Now it's all. It feels kind of restrictive. It feels like you can't really say what you want to, and you know, it, well, you can, but you will just not get <laughs> heard. <laughs> uh, n nobody will hear you. <laughs> it feels like that. It feels a little restrictive. It wasn't like that previously. Uh, so, which is why um, I have never uh, put any ads uh, uh, in my videos. If you ever see ads in any of my videos, those are not mine. It's just because maybe somebody else claimed that video, even though it was in the public domain, you know. That's also a big problem and a, a big a big uh, issue I have with YouTube is that any idiot uh, can uh, claim copyright to any kind of video uh, of which he doesn't even have the copyright. You know, <laughs> so um, uh, yeah. So uh, I haven't infringed on anyone's copyright. I, I think, um, but I have uploaded some. You know stuff that is in the public domain and you know because it is in the public domain any idiot can claim a, well shouldn't be able but apparently on YouTube it is like that that if someone something is in the public domain any idiot can claim the copyright for it you know so if you if you see uh, uh, any ads on any of my videos those are not my ads you know uh, those are ads by some other guy who's claiming copyright for uh, 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 footage that is in the public domain, you know, so <laughs> which makes no sense at all. Why, uh, you know, <laughs> I, I feel like if if people are claiming copyright uh, 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 for something and, and and are putting ads into other people's videos, they should have to show some proof that they actually own that footage but on YouTube it seems like anybody just can can just claim 
uh, that they owe uh, something that they obviously don't, um, that they own something that they obviously don't own, and then um, uh, uh, put ads into other people's videos or even uh, force other people to take those videos down, even though they they don't really, uh, they, even though they're not really copyrighted. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, well, yeah, I don't, I don't like YouTube, no. <laughs> because it's doing all those things and um, and because of that um, I have long decided not to um, uh, uh, put any ads into any of my videos um, yeah I uh, yeah it's it's a it's a decision that that is kind of hard because I just realized that I could have actually made a lot of money well relatively you know at least for me I could have made um, actually not that much money just you know but I could have made some money uh, if I would have uh, enabled ads uh, but I, de I decided not to also I <laughs> what is the most sneaky is that if you disable ads they will disable a lot of your features uh, for example, if you disable ads, you, you cannot schedule your videos. Which, why? Why? Why do I uh, have, uh, uh, have to uh, enable um, ads to be able to, to, to schedule my videos? That doesn't make any sense. You know, it's like they're punishing you. They're, they're like they're saying, oh, you, 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 you're not making money for us, so we will punish you and remove all those features, you know, because that's not the only feature they remove. They remove all kinds of features if you, if, if you, um, if you don't display the ads. So, <laughs> yeah, they're doing a lot of sneaky things. And uh, uh, that's precisely why I don't want to support that, that greed, that greedy mentality. And that's why I don't want to display ads, even though I could make a lot of money for, from it. But I also feel that ads are kind, ads are, are kind of uh, distracting, you know? Um, because you don't know what kind of ads will show up. All kinds of garbage, right? So um, I'd, I'd like to think that the stuff I'm uploading is um, well, is 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 useful. It's good stuff. <laughs> it's, uh, as opposed to a lot of the things that a lot of ads, uh, a lot of the advertisement is um, is is showing. Those are mostly not 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 nice, <laughs> not nice things. <laughs> so I don't want to support that. So I don't want to display ads. Um, yeah. <laughs> so that that's that's why I um, intentionally don't don't want to show ads. Yeah, I, I wish more people would be doing that because actually most people, you know, if you don't have a lot of views, you're not making any money out of the ads anyway. But people are still um, they, they're pursuing uh, uh, that so strongly. It's like with the subscribers I talked about earlier. Subscribers are by now. Your subscriber count is, 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 is basically meaningless, but people are still so obsessed about having a lot of subscribers, and it's the same uh, uh, with with the, the with, with the advertisement. People are so obsessed with uh, with the advertisement and with making a little money uh, out of the advertisement, even though they're really not make. Most of the people who who are using advertisements uh, for their YouTube videos, they're not. They're really not making a lot of money. In any case, YouTube is of course making the most money, right? So, so, and, and they're really not making a lot of money with that, but uh, but they they're still doing it, and and they're pursuing it, and they and they think they become they they, they will become rich and famous and 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 and, and, and will make uh, millions of dollars like I don't know PewDiePie or whatever, and 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 that just won't happen, <laughs> and they know it won't happen, but they're still pursuing it. And I, I don't think that's a good mentality. I don't, I don't want to support that. <laughs> and, and maybe, maybe I, I can inspire you to do the same. And, you know, to kind of, you know, I'm not telling you to boycott the ads, but uh, maybe to boycott that that kind of mentality. You know, that, that uh, because 
I, I feel like that's a hollow pursuit, you know, that that greed or something, you know. I feel that that's hollow. So maybe I can inspire you to uh, <laughs> to to boycott that that kind of uh, greedy mentality that that YouTube sometimes inspires in people. So.